Thanks to the variable SID, the generator separated from the high-performance X-ray tube, high-speed rotating anode with diameter 102 millimeters, a thermal anode capacity of 600,000 thermal units, and an anodic dissipation of 154,000 thermal units per minute, values that far exceed competitors' analogs, the cardioversion models of the Alien E family stand out as the world's highest performing mobile C-arms. They are one of a kind. The peculiarity of these systems is that despite being mobile on wheels, they are able to perform the same clinical procedures that until now have normally been performed only using stationary systems. All this thanks to a very deep arm that has the ability to move on five axes, unique in the world, ensuring total isocentrism on all projections. Thanks to innovative X-ray tube temperature control systems, all radiological emission parameters are constantly controlled and normalized by sophisticated software, which, taking into account the information coming from the cooling system and the type of procedure in progress, manages the acquisition frame rate and pulse and the RX exposure parameters in real time, guaranteeing perfect images even during particularly demanding procedures. All imaging parameters are optimized in terms of RX dose emission to protect both the patient and the operator without ever having to give up the quality of the images. For this reason, both the X-ray beam filtrations and the dose released to the patient are kept under strict control by special automatisms, which act and constantly self-regulate during the X-ray emission. The system is equipped with a particular algorithm capable of recognizing the type of objects present in the irradiated field, even if not positioned in the center of it, and defining in real time the optimal exposure and display values together with contrast and brightness. An LED light and a laser pointer are available to facilitate the centering of the district to be examined. The operator's monitor is split screen and adjustable with the possibility of motorized height variation. It is protected against accidental bumps and has a maximum size of over 31 inches with a resolution of 4K. The management of the entire system is guaranteed by two 15.6-inch touchscreen displays, which, in addition to displaying images, can control the functions of the entire system. The additional interfaces, both the multifunctional footswitch and the console equipped with joysticks, use the wireless connection. This increases safety and makes sanitization easier. The two touchscreen displays are synchronized, but they can also work asynchronously to optimize times within the operating room and facilitate work even in the presence of a double operator. One display is positioned on the C-arm, while the second, located in the rear part of the monitor trolley, ensures that the technologist will work in total safety, away from the sterile field and from ionizing radiation, while maintaining total control over the system, both hardware and software. The system can be equipped with additional optional touchscreen displays, which can be freely positioned inside the room or at the patient's bed, or integrated into the useful dedicated trolley. Alien E is prepared for our fusion software. Thanks to the work of the company's internal research and development department, Euro Columbus is currently the only company that can boast this technology integrated with the software managing a mobile system. The application software, complete with all standard packages, including full DICOM connectivity, works in a Linux environment and is supported by top-level hardware. All safety and control procedures are active and functioning simultaneously and in real time. This makes it possible to further increase patient safety thanks to the continuous control of the active anti-collision system functioning simultaneously on both the detector side and the X-ray tube side, unique in the world to be able to stop the movement before the collision from both sides. Alien E Cardioversion much more than just a C-arm. Why not test it in your operating room?